Hello friends, Winston here. Welcome to the world of carnivorous plants. Rhodula gorganius is just a kind of plant. If you look at it, it should remind you of the Draceras and the Sundews. In many ways, it's similar. Look at it, you notice the insects, which are trapped in between the leaves. And as far as characteristics go, it is generally the same, except for one slight difference. Once the insects are trapped, this plant species does not have the ability to crush them and use the nutrients as food. Surprisingly, to grow this plant, you have to use the old-fashioned method, some kind of fertilizer. Roridula is native to South Africa. Yes, you've heard me right, South Africa. And it's one of two species in the genus. Okay, to grow it, you will have to do, as I said, the old-fashioned way. In the ground, it may grow four, five, six feet tall. And if you're in a temperate climate like me, you will probably be better off opting for the pots. That way you can tr control it better. And definitely. Some people see it as only marginally carnivorous, but looking at the attractive plant it is, it is carnivorous enough for me, and I think it's more than worth growing. Have a look around. It's very rare, and it's only rarely you'll come across it at nurseries. If you do grab it, I think it's about time we elevate this species to a pride of place in this collection of plant. Roridula gorganius, my video plant of the moment. And this is a plant which I think that you should try and grow. Thank you.